Okay, welcome to the video on the slope of a line. This is our lesson for this topic, and uh, the objectives for this video is, of course, we want to understand the concept of the slope of a line, and then we're going to go ahead and determine the slope of a line by looking at uh, the graph of a particular line. Then we're going to learn the slope formula and determine the slope of a line by um, using two coordinates that are on that line. So let's go right to slope. So what's the slope of a line? Well, let's suppose I had a line here. Let me draw myself a line. And I said, given this particular line here, what's the angle of this line? Well, one way to describe the angle would be by using degrees. But another way, the way we're talking about here, is to use something called slope. And what the slope is, the slope compares how much the line rises in reference to how much it runs out. All right, and the abbreviation for slope in algebra is m. Okay, so m is the slope, and what we're doing is we're comparing two components of this line. Okay, you can think of this triangle as as part of this line. Okay, and we call this part the the height, if you will, the rise, and we call this component the run. So what's happening here is this line is going out 10 and rising 10. Okay, so for every 10 it runs, it, it rises um, 10. Okay, the slope by definition is the rise over the run. Okay, we're comparing those two values. So in this particular case, the line is rising 10 for every 10 it runs out. So this line has a slope of 1. Now that's kind of easy. Let's take a look at another line that's a little bit more um, interesting. Okay, maybe we can have you do it. Okay. How about this particular line here? So, let's look at the slope of this line. So, once again, we want to find its rise value. So, that's this value in reference to its run value. Now, I'm making a nice triangle up against this line. You can make the triangle anywhere, but I'm making this triangle in such a way where it's going to be easy for me to measure the rise and the run. Okay, so the slope here is its rise, and here, if you count carefully, it's rising 10 for every 5 it runs out. Okay, remember, this is the run, and this is the rise. Okay, so for every 10 it rises, it's, it's running 2, or excuse me, running 5. So the slope is 2. And that's it. So basically the slope, let's wrap this up, is nothing but a number, okay, usually expressed as a fraction, that expresses the angle or steepness of a line. That's all it does. Okay, and this is going to be very, very important in your study of um, algebra. Okay, so let's go down to this particular problem. Let's draw ourselves a line. It's going to find the slope of a line given its graph. So let's draw another line here. So let's suppose we had this line here. Now if you think you can figure this out, I'd say go for it. Go ahead and pause.